<laughs> Hi, Susan. Um, we, we have a wonderful privilege this morning. Um, uh, one of our worship team members and um, is studying for the ministry. He's, he's, complete, he's working on his master's in divinity. And so um, he's in the process of um, studying for uh, the ministry to become ordained in the Church of the Nazarene. And this morning we want to honor you, Chris Balby, if you would come up here. Yeah, um, Chris, we want to give you this. Um, the church board voted on this, and we interviewed you, and you in the, are in the course of study. So this license that we give you from our local church is valid for one year. Okay. All right? Um, if you behave yourself. Um, so what it says is here that Chris Balby is, a li is licensed as a local minister in the Church of the Nazarene for one year, provided that his spirit and practice are such as become the gospel of, of Jesus Christ, and his teachings correspond with the established church, um, uh, with the established doctrines of the Holy Scriptures how held by the said church. Um, and this is done by order of our local church mm -hmm. through the general church. Um, I know it's a bit of a process, but we got this um, this past week, and um, so we want to honor you one week earlier than, okay. than what the date is on here, but because... We, we count it as such a privilege, and um, we're all behind you. We will pray for you. We will support you. Um, we will push you. Um, we will encourage you, right, board, and strengthen you as you serve the Lord and you begin this wonderful adventure. Um, Sharon, I've been work, walking with the Lord for over 40-something 40, 40 years in service, in service to the Lord. Um, and we've, we've never looked back. There were difficult times, and there will be difficult times and challenging times. But that's why we are here, and that's why your church is here, and your church board is here. So let's give Chris a wonderful <laughs> congratulations. Join us in prayer as we pray for Chris. Father, um, thank you for Chris's life and, Lord, the transformation that you brought into his life. Lord, for walking with him and bringing him to this point. Lord, and we ask that, that as he serves you, Lord, that you would encourage him and strengthen him. Lord, undergird him. And when it gets difficult with the studies and ministry, Lord Jesus, that he would just remember that you called him and renew that call on his life. Many times, Lord Jesus, reassure him, Father, of your great love and how special he is to you, Lord. So, Lord, as a church, we uplift him before you, asking you, O oh God, to strengthen him in his resolve. Lord, help him in, uh, in those studies, and, and, and Lord, that when he completes the task assigned to him, Lord, that the next step is ordination into the full-time ministry. Jesus, we pray for our brother, and we lay hands on him and Lord from this first step on Jesus in your name we do pray Amen, Amen. Amen. Love you Don't brother week, <laughs> Thank you Chris Congratulations Oh, By the way you invited to share with us in a celebration downstairs with a cake to honor Chris as well Amen <laughs>